Something they're getting off those Zoom calls and getting back onto planes. Business travel is back with a vengeance for the first time in more than a year. And for a lot of people, that's a blessing and a curse. Let's bring in our business and tech reporter, Scott Budman, who joins us from SJC. Is it busy there right now, Scott? Yeah, a little busier, and it's been busier and busier by the week, Raj. One of the ways we've been tracking the comeback, in fact, is at local airports like here at SJC. And it's not just travel for pleasure that is making a comeback, but also travel for business as well, up 19% from March to April, according to TSA, with another jump so far in June. People, they say, are more comfortable traveling and coming back to work. So now sales calls and merger talks are happening in person once again. I mean, it's all the um, relationship building, you know, you can't really have like a three hour d dinner right over Zoom. There's no replacement for in person uh, relationships. And we've really been finding that the business people are getting back to business. Yeah, we know SJC where you are, Oakland and SFO is picking up in a big way. Scott, though, what about people who moved away to work remotely during this pandemic? Are those now flights coming back in for the to come to check into the office? Yeah, they are. You know, the travel watchers here in the Bay Area tell us that's one of the factors in the boost in business travel. Tech companies that allowed their employees to move away during the pandemic now say they want them back at the office at least some of the time. So they're hopping on planes. OK, and that coupled with all the vacation that families are going to be taking the next couple of months, it's going to be busy at the airports. Thank you. Scott Budman reporting at San Jose International.